20%. President William Ruto says with a conscious effort at restructuring financing policies, the government could increase revenue generated by the border border sector by at least 400 million shillings a month. The border border sector contributes about 100,000 shillings to the national revenue per month. The government reckons this could be increased by 40% if certain taxes and policy regulations are adjusted. To me, ondoa ushuru kama sehemu tano ili kusaidia sekta hiyo kukua. Ya kwanza, tumesema VAT kwa boda boda ambayo inatumia stima tutaondoa 16% VAT ile iko juu yake. As on top of the cost that you have reduced, we are going to partner with you in creating the charging stations and reducing the licenses. Uh, ile, ile cost ya licenses ambao each station is required to pay and the rates applicable to them. President William Ruto says the migration from fossil-fueled motorbikes to electric motorbikes will be fully realized in a few years, and the country will have 200,000 e-bikes on the roads by the end of 2024. Kwa sasa hivi, tuko na pikipiki the mbazo zinatumia stima kama zile zinatengenezwa hapa haifiki 2000 Kenya if we do roll out 30% we are working on 30% accelerated border border by 2025 which will give us up to 500,000 motorbikes on the road he says domestic financing architecture interventions will bring down costs in the e-mobility sector and that the government would push for the adoption of climate conscious modes of transportation for Kenya to reach carbon neutrality by the year 2050, the e-mobility sector must grow by 10% per annum. To this effect, the president says e-bikes will grow from the current 2,000 to 200,000 by the end of next year. Hibak Said for TV 47.